This episode we got the Suzuki Vitara. First we're gonna do is leave the car and change the tires. We're changing the summer tire for the winter tires. So let's begin with the lifting. Now the car is lifted and let's begin. For this process I'm gonna use a 70 millimeter socket. And let's begin. And this is it. Our first tire is gone. Now for my next step, I'm going to remove the valve core. After that, we're going to break the bit. After we break the bit, we remove the weights. Because I don't know if this is TPMS or not, I'm doing it like it was pre TPMS. I move this cover. And now I begin right before the well. First I lubricate the machine. And then we begin. This is TPMS. So good, we begin with this step to not damage the wall. After this, this angle you can see how I begin. Always because this is a TPMS, wolf and sensor, always we begin with this. So then we press the pedal. This is it. Now you can see our TPMS sensor sensor and we don't damage it. Back this is our stop position. And now we just turn it. This is outside, this is inside. And now we're filling it with air. And let it pop. Now we're moving. So as we break the lid, 
Or you counterwise the valve because if the valve is in our way, we will break it. So our valve is here, so we can push that. Now we move the valve here. Push all the way and press the tire. The tire is ready for the tire machine. So, this is not in the way. Then we move the dock, we lock the dock, we lubricate, and then Push it. And always start before the duck's head. Because if you do like that, you won't damage the TPMS. You, you do the other side, you damage the TPMS. And look how nice it goes. So now we're gonna leave the tire over the TPMS and use this tool to grab it. After we grab it, we are over the TPMS sensor and now we just simply press the pedal. Here is our TPMS. Here is our the tire and no worries for the TPMS. This is rear left, second left, or rear left, second left, or rear left. So this is how you mount it off. Now we're going to put another on. So, our step is like in our first tire. First we lubricate. You must loop the tire because if you don't loop it will rip off. So it's like better on the machine. After looping the tire for this side, then we loop this and this. After looping, we're looping here. It says inside, so this goes to the inside, and here it says outside. Now we're gonna rotate back the machine. Our TPMS sensor is here. So, first we're gonna take the tire, then we mount the dock, and if you can see, here is our tire, here is our TPMS, look it, here is TPMS, here is the tire, and now we begin to mount it. After this first step, we rotate back the machine, here is our TPMS. And this is it. We're moving the dock. We're letting the tire. And now it's feeling tight.
So the compressor will be on. I'm gonna pause this. Now here's for a different angle. I will move this aside so you can better see. So I begin. Our TPMS is here. I'm gonna move it clockwise. So if you can see how TPMS is in here. This is the same distance for him. I have to write this from this side. I'm gonna move it like this. So our TPMS is here on the other side. If I wait for the machine, I balance in the meantime. First I press this way, then this way. Here it goes. Then. 25. Tighten down, we move to this way. Always check for the ball.
after this through. So now you can see the DPMA sensor and how I'm doing it. So this is it. And nice and easy, the car is removed. On the other side, and as well, in this inner piece, and then we put it like that. We place the dock and lock it. As you can see, our TPMS is to save. Then we press the pedal. After pressing the pedal, we move it back. Here is our TPMS. And then we press the pedal again. Then we remove the dock and fill the tire. And this is how I mount wheels with TPMS. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel, give a thumbs up, comment how do you do, have a nice day, peace and out. episode we got the Suzuki Vitara first we're gonna do is leave the car and change the tires we are changing the summer tire for the winter tires so let's begin with the lifting the car is lifted and let's begin for this process I'm gonna use a 70 millimeter socket and let's begin This is it, our first tire is down. Now I don't wanna show you the others because the video is gonna be too long. I'm moving to the next tree and then see you on the tire machine.